Okay, in today's tutorial we're going to take a look at the idea of changing the normal style within Microsoft Word. Uh, in Office 2007 and 2010, uh, Microsoft made changes to the font, the font size, line spacing, paragraph spacing uh, in the normal style in Microsoft Word. So, you know, we've gone through Times New Roman, size 12, single spaced, and so on. Now we're seeing Calibri as the default font, size 11. Uh, we're also seeing some paragraph space that we didn't have before in the normal style. Um, along with line spacing at 1.15. So a lot of people have asked me, you know, how do I change uh, this back to what it was before or just simply take control of it and pick whatever I want uh, in regards to my normal line spacing, my font font size, and so forth. So there are two ways to do this, and uh, the first way that I'm going to demo I feel is probably the most straightforward way uh, to make changes to the default font, and then I'll take a look at a more traditional way uh, in regards to just actually editing the normal style. So uh, in the home tab on the ribbon look for your styles group it's uh, probably one of the significantly larger groups uh, on your home tab this particular group does have a dialog box launcher in the corner of it so I'm going to go ahead and click that and a style panel comes up this is dockable by the way you could push it off to the side and snap it in and so forth I'm just gonna let mine float uh, at the bottom of that styles panel there are three buttons that look very similar the first one is new style next one is style inspector and the third one is manage styles. So if you're looking to change the ingredients to your normal style, manage styles is probably the most direct way to do it. So I'm going to click on the manage styles button, which is going to take me into the manage styles dialog box. Now there are four tabs in this dialog box, edit, recommend, restrict, and set defaults. Set defaults is the tab that you want. And within this tab of this dialog box, what you want to do is pick the font that you would like to see as your normal font. So I'm just going to be a little nostalgic here and come down and choose Times New Roman. There we go. I think I'll go with a size of 12. I'm going to leave the color at automatic. Not going to do any crazy indentation or anything like that. But I am going to come down and remove this additional after paragraph spacing. Uh, that's in the new normal recipe. I'm going to back that down to zero. And I'm also going to put my line spacing back to single instead of 1.15. Now before you click OK, double check that everything is in place that you want and make sure that you choose this option, new documents based on this template. What this means is from this point forward when you bring up a new Word document it's going to set the default style of normal to the ingredients that you chose in this dialog box. I'm going to click OK and that changes my normal style. You see up here in my font group it's now Times New Roman, size 12, single space, left align, no extra paragraph spacing. So that's one way, probably the most direct route to go in regards to making a permanent change to your normal style for new documents within your Microsoft Word. Now a more traditional route uh, would be to either find the style within the ribbon in the live style preview area or find it within the style list off to the right. Uh, either place you can modify the style. So if we were going through uh, the ribbon I could right click on normal and choose modify. If I were going through the style panel off to the right I could hit the drop down and go into modify. Uh, this is essentially the same thing. Uh, you would come in, change your font, change your size. You may have to dig a little deeper into the paragraph area to uh, modify line spacing and paragraph spacing. But once you had everything in place, once again, before you click OK, you want to choose this option down at the bottom, New Documents Based on this Template, meaning new files from this point forward will take on the ingredients that have been listed and specified in this normal style. So either way is going to do it for you. And um, again, this is something that will stay locked in until you go to choose and modify it again. So hope this helps you out. Until next time.